Yeah, it should be. Huh. Hey, good morning, AB. Good morning. Yeah, that's right, boy. Oh, hey, good morning, new girl. Yeah, you're the newest calf we have, right? And you're hungry, I bet, huh? everybody on this uh, nice windy windy-ish November day today is Monday November 23rd and uh, you can't complain about the weather because last year at this time I think we had uh, whew, we had snow on the ground so yes yeah, so anyways I hope you guys are doing great I'm doing pretty good and uh, like I say, we're just enjoying this weather, staying busy with things, just staying busy. So anyways, um, I'm just gonna, I just got done feeding the milk cows. I'm gonna work at the young stock and uh, let me get here in the tractor. What else are we going to be? What else are we going to be doing here today? Um, I'm going to feed the young stock. And then I got to grind some hay for the uh, milk cows because uh, we got some fourth cutting hay and the protein in there is higher. So we're going to mix some of that with our second cutting hay that we're feeding. Because starting in December, um, we get a, a setup on our milk. They pay us an incentive from December through February. And so, obviously we want to get our milk production up so that we can make use of that because we're still, right now, if you don't know, our organic milk market is still, you know, kind of, it's not quite where it should be yet. Well, it's still not where it should be. But anyways, um, we have a quota. We can only produce so much milk each month and we're not even meeting our quota. We're not anywhere close to meeting our quota. So, for, you know, if you go over it, you get you get docked so many dollars on your milk. And uh, so, thankfully, we haven't gone over that, so we haven't lost money that way. But we're not reaching our potential. So we want to get our milk production up. So we're going to mix some of that in there with there with that. So that's why I need to grind some of that. I ground some hay yesterday. I didn't record any video, but and my brother, he is still working on that one field that's 12 miles southwest of here. So we will get to that, or he's gonna go over there and work at that thing. Maybe he'll get that. I don't know. Maybe he'll get some footage of it too. But we'll see what happens. But I gotta work a little bit at the feeding, and then uh, we'll see what goes down here today. I guess that's all we can do. Is give her a go.
Okay, I'm gonna fire this thing up here, get it warming up. Um, obviously, I had the charger on this thing because the alternator on this tractor isn't working. My cousin, he claimed it was working at one point, but I don't think it was. I think it's just because he had charged the battery up the night before. And the gauge in there just shows how much juice is in the battery. So he think he thought it was charging, but it's not. So I put it on trickle charge all night. I got it plugged in, so it should start up. But I need to go inside the tub in here and grease one of the bearings. Um, I got everything else greased up yesterday, but well, I'll show you. there's a bearing back under here. You can't see it, but uh, it's easier to get at it. There's an access cover in there, so I'll get at it there, and then um, we'll get that fourth cut hay ground. So we'll see if this old beast starts up. It should. Okay, I'm going to start this thing up and I need to grind a quick bit or a batch of um, ground oats just to, we're gonna fill up the fill up the feed grinder full of oats because we just decided that um, we're probably gonna need to uh, conserve on on um, corn a little bit for the cows and if we mix a little bit of oats in with it we'll just, you know, we'll just I'm gonna put the ground oats in that bulk bin that's next to the barn up there and so we'll just run a little bit of that on there. You know, that way we won't have to put somewhere to ground or that high moisture corn on, and it'll just make the, stretch the corn out a little bit longer. So we have it now. So anyways, I'm gonna, I think I'm just gonna grind it. I'll unload it tomorrow. Um, I did not take the, my cousin's hay grinder back because the lights don't work on there. Very good. And the alternator isn't working. So I'll have to do that tomorrow. So I'm gonna quick get these, uh, Get this jo old Johnny Popper fired up and do that job. Whew, hey, good morning, everybody. <laughs> it is the second day of this video, and same video for you guys. And uh, we got a little shot of rain here last night. Not much. I don't even know how much we got. So, anyway, because we got a shot of rain last night, I didn't, like I said, I didn't bring this thing back. I gotta plug this thing in because I'm gonna bring it back today. Otherwise, if I don't plug the, the block heater, you won't get that thing started. So, I'm gonna plug this in quick. And then, I'm gonna go milk some cows. And, and then, after we get done milking cows, um, we got the hoof trimmer coming here today. He is gonna come and trim about, I don't know. We got a few cows that need to be done up and some, some bread heifers. So, I don't know, maybe it's like, I don't know, 10, 15 animals we gotta have done up, so. <coughs> Excuse me, so yeah. That's kinda what we got going on here, part of what we got going on here today. Um, but I need I need both hands for this job apparently. So we'll go get the cows milked and 
then by that time the hoof trimmer should be here and we'll get that job done with and I think I'm gonna take let's get this tractor back here a little bit after milking here and get it out of here and get it back for my cousins again Okay, I'm gonna quick fire up, fire up old Smokey there, get that warming up, and then while that's warming up, I'm gonna go load some hay on the feeder wagon for the young stock, and I'm gonna get this tractor out of here. Guess what everybody it is the end of the video and the end of a very long day it seemed like it was a very long day for me anyways maybe it didn't seem that way in the second half of this video but oh so yeah at least we got some cows hooves trimmed and that's done but it sounds like the weather isn't going to be too bad here um going into next week so at this time last year we had I think we had snow on the ground, so, and the ground was frozen, we couldn't work it, and speaking of working the ground, uh, my brother, he's still not done on that one field yet, um, that's 12 miles southwest of here, I don't know, I think he said he's got about 30 acres, it's just that it takes longer when you're disc chiseling, because a disc chisel, disc chisel is 14 feet wide, so you're only taking 14 feet, and the whole field was like 75 acres or something, so, and he's not putting in full days. He's only maybe working for two or three hours at a time. If he could get, even if he could get one full afternoon in, it would really help. But, well, he'll get her done. So, anyways, um, yeah, like I said, we still got some manure to haul and things like that. And uh, what is the day it is? Well, it's actually after midnight, so that means it is, geez, it's Wednesday. So, the next, tomorrow will be Thanksgiving already. Mm. Yep, and of course you'll be watching this two weeks later, so, because I'm still two weeks behind, but I'll eventually get caught up. Things are slowing down, so I probably won't be making as many videos, and I'll finally get sort of caught up.
so anyways i'm tired i'm hungry and um i'm gonna go hit the hay sack so anyways guys thanks for watching please don't forget to like rate comment and subscribe and check me out on instagram twitter and at parlor all at organic dairyman and um i guess have a good night take care and uh see you guys in the next video